guys, Slumgrove Warrior here, and today we're back with another episode of Roguelands. So, today the update, which has been 0.9.1 or 0.9, I don't know, maybe it, it, there was a patch, so it might be 0.9.1, but all that I know is that um, the big thing was that you got new special abilities for every ultimate weapon that is either a sword or a lance, and I'm not big into lances, but swords are my jazz. But uh, first of all, this is a thing I got in between episodes from the Ringabolt NPC. It's Ringabolt's axe, and the good thing about this thing is, well, first of all, it has higher uh, strength stats. Um, it doesn't have faith, which is kind of meh, but it does this. So it sends out projectiles, it also does half damage uh, each time, but it pierces enemies as well, which is all very great, but uh, yeah. Other than that, I think there was were some new cards added and the poison status effect, but we won't be going into those two, but we'll be going into the weapons. So, as you can see, I have a lot of shards and all that with me, and we're going to go to, oh, to Max City, because that's where we do all this shit, and let's go there. And first of all, let's see if we can make some more of these babies. Thank you very much. That's a lot. That's a decent amount. Yeah, it sure is. Let's make some weapons. So let's see what weapons we already have. And um, we have a shield of this one. And some ultimate of those. And this where it gets stored. Um, this one does have uh, the Excalibur, but I made this before this uh, was implemented. But yeah, we're gonna make some swords. Um, I think it's over here. No. It's over here. Oh, yeah, I'm so fucking stupid. Um, let's go for Ragnarok first, and I'm thinking at a light. Uh, what now? I'm just must be same tier. Okay, interesting. Um, but yeah, let's do this. It's the Vel Flame. Um, now I actually know that this was making the Vel Flame. I know there's two weapons that come from this that have a Fire Emblem reference, um, which is why I wanted to make this one. Let's see what it does. It... Wow. You don't even have to swing, it just shoots projectiles. That's fucking amazing. Now this one is more complicated. Um, there were two that seemed pretty decent, uh, which were neither of this one. So we're gonna, I'm gonna toss a coin. Um, let's see. Where's my coin? Um, heads will be Omega, and tails will be Dark. That's definitely a thing. And it's going to be Omega. So let's take this and do this. And Omega it is. So let's see what it brings us. A ruin. What do you do, my kind sir? That looks cool. And it really looks in the shape of my character as well, which is why I wanted to do the Doom Guard, because I knew we'd be getting one kind of dark thing. I wonder what the others were. I wonder how good they were. Eventually I want to get a load of different uh, ultimate swords. I don't really care for a lot of the other armors because my character has the faith and strength. But I, I will be upgrading these later on into what they are going to be. Wow, they're, they have great stats. But first, one thing we still need to do, and um, let's uh, throw these shards and all that back here first. Um, we need to get some new... Well, the crit damage. Let's see, that's that's what we always did. So let's go for crit and damage. Um, crit damage. Um, crit rate and what do we want as well? We had bonus strength. Do I want that? I don't really care for bonus strength right now. I would like some health again, I guess. Hmm, it's a hard one. EXP boost? Let's put us an EXP boost. Um, so let's upgrade all of these the same way. Um, first, crit damage. Then, crit damage. Oh, well, crit rate. And then EXP boost. Because who doesn't want some nice EXP boost? Um, same for this one. EXP boost. Crit damage and crit rate. 
and let's put you back, and then we have to go good foul flame, and then ruin, which also has a farm reference if you uh, take at the. There is a tome called Ruin, and there is a tome called Fell of Flame. So, I'm liking these references, man. Um, really do. They're fucking cool. I have cool sword. I have cool weapons now. I wanna upgrade them. So, let's take it for a test drive, I guess. Um, we'll just do a... Uh, let's do a, nor a tier 1. Because they're not that great yet. Um, so, let's do tier 1 of the Desolate Canyon. And let's start out with Fell of Flame. Let's see how good you do. No, this was the one that has this. Um, it is half magic, which is not kind of my my thing here because I am not a magic user. But I might eventually get into magic, and then magic and sword might be a good idea. I don't know. I should be creating new characters soon, but I don't really want to until I have defeated the game. Um. But this is a good weapon though. I mean, you get free damage. You don't even have to do anything. You can just sit here. And just shoot it from everywhere. Dip. 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 But that's the Valve Flame. Let's try Ruin. So you have a little shield. I think it reduces damage. So there's a nice amount of damage. So, 400. We have 400. Yeah, it does 400. Of course, um, that one does a little bit more, but let's see how it fares against everything. So let's put on our photo blades and kill Urkin, or whatever you're called. And you're dead. That's great. Uh, why did we heal so fast? Wait, let, let's check that actually. Um, can I get hit? It reduces damage. I only get hit one for one damage. Damn. I didn't move. One. And then. One. And let's see without. Without is eight. Holy shit, that does a lot. Damn, that's a good sword. That's how you survive things. I mean, I know that. Um, uh, in the end, uh, the developer wants to make this game way hard with, like, hard hitting mobs and all. So this sword will be really coming in handy. I mean, Springable's X also is really good because you have this. So it's either run or fight for your life. That's interesting. Um, so out of the two right now, I think the rune is better because I'm not a mage class or I don't have magic. So let's upgrade you with one. The beep. And that's, that's nice. Sorry, I'm on. Um, let's check if there's something here I want to have, and if not, we can leave. But yeah, I've been doing real good for myself um, on Roadlands, by the way. Uh, if I want to start a new character and want it to be magic and all that, I have some ultimate stuff. Um, I can try heroic armor at the beginning, but it's not that great. Um, we can use 4th Age armor and Broccoli Helmet because it's also magic. Um, this one would should give me the needed strength, and this one could give me some, you know, some magic, so I could be the broccoli warrior of gold. Sounds fucking amazing. And that is a little bit. I don't know what I want to do with that because you can't upgrade it uh, right now, which kind of sucks. But hey, I mean, I do everything. So let's go back, and I think that's going to be it. I mean, they didn't add in. No, he gone. I uh, didn't add like a new biome or something for me to explore. So I mean, it was fun, like getting all these new weapons. Fucking amazing, and I'll put you back. Uh, wait, this is my ultimate stuff. Um, but yeah, I wanted to give some stuff to say some stuff uh, first for ending the episode. Um, I have a Rogue Lands community on Google Plus. The link of that will be in the description below. You can post anything Rogue Lands related, uh, from you know uh, helpful ideas to glitches or like crafting recipes. Of course, there is. A wiki of roguelands but that's not the same as the community so i thought i'd make one so yeah that, that's there and yeah i hope you enjoyed my video please leave a like if you did comment down below uh what ultimate weapon is your favorite because well all the melee weapons now have special attacks so what's your favorite ability of all the melee and yeah subscribe keep updated with my daily videos close to uh, in a month it will return 
But um, yeah, I'm Samker Warrior. I hope you enjoyed again. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.